It's time for Small Talk. It was part of an experiment of mine that backfired. Before you finish with your little speech. Now, the host of Small Talk, Jack Patrick. Thanks for watching SportsBone.tv. Stick around after this. Gratz has some highlights from the tailgate tour. But for now, I'm Jack Patrick. This is Small Talk. Our guest today is an absolute maniac. He won Defensive Rookie of the Year in 2002 and since then has been a first-team consensus All-Pro, having gone to the Pro Bowl in each of his last three seasons. I am excited. I am happy to welcome number 90 into Studio 42, Carolina Panthers defensive end Julius Peppers. Julius, welcome to the show. Thanks a lot for being here today. Well, thanks for having me, Jack Patrick. <laughs> Hmm. You got a nice smell coming off you, Jack Patrick. What you have for breakfast? Some biscuits and gravy or something? No biscuits and gravy for me today, Julius. Well, something sure smells good around here. Maybe they got some lunch in the next room or something. Perhaps they do. I don't know. Now, Julius, I gotta tell you, I'm a really big fan of yours. And I think I speak for all Panther fans when I say... What happened last Sunday against the Texans? Everybody's saying that, and I don't know what to say. It's like what I told Coach Sean Fox. I remember warm-ups. I remember we was winning, but then I don't even remember playing after that. I was just watching myself on the video, and I was yelling at myself, Jack Patrick. I was yelling, saying, get these men run away with your hamburger, Julius Peppers on TV. But I didn't get him. I stand around like a lonely old junkyard dog or something. I was mad at Julius Peppers on TV. Well, geez, Julius, it sounds like perhaps you suffered a concussion. Sean Fox told me I must have had a cu. I must have had a con. Uh, I must have had a con. A concussion. Yeah, a construction. Right. Well. Personally, I feel better in knowing that that's the case, Julius, to be honest with you. Hmm. Hmm. Coach John Fox said I can eat all the food I want to as long as I go out on the field and tackle all these men be trying to steal my roast beef sandwich. Beef sandwich? What do you mean, Julius? And Coach John Fox say, if I don't stop these mans and get my food back, I won't get to eat all the food I want. I love my food, and I need my food so I can lift my weights, so I can chase these mans and be trying to take away my food. It's cool, Julius. Don't worry about it. We know you're just, you're a hard worker, Julius. <laughs> What's that noise? What noise? Hey, you know what, Jack Patrick? You and me got the same initials. My name Julius Peppers, JP, and your name Jack Patrick, JP. <laughs> I guess I never thought about that, Julius. Now, Julius, Atlanta Falcons, how do you feel, buddy? If we win, I do a good job. Coach John Fox gonna take me that butcher shop I love and give me some big old steaks and sausage and... Hmm. Okay, Julius. I think it goes without saying that the Atlanta Falcons are a much different team without Michael Vick. That man's always run away with my hamburger. I used to have dreams about that man's. I couldn't ever catch that man's. Running, throwing so fast. I ain't like that man's. <laughs> All right, let's send it to Gratz. It's kicking off the tailgate tour in Pittsburgh. Let's check out some highlights. <laughs> 